Get full coverage auto insurance. Need affordable full coverage car insurance. The first thing that needs to be mentioned is that there is no such thing. Every insurance policy has limitations and exclusions for items such as wear and tear, maintenance, and negligent actions by the insured. The term full auto coverage insurance is usually referring to a policy with the following coverages, first party auto coverages, comprehensive this is for damage caused to the insured vehicle by a loss due to something other than collision. Typically, this will be fire, theft, vandalism, and weather damage. Collision This is for damage to the insured vehicle by a loss due to collision with another object. Towing and roadside assistance This is usually access to a 24-hour service in the event of a mechanical or other problem with your vehicle. Rental reimbursement in the event that the insured vehicle becomes undrivable, this will provide a limited amount of reimbursement for a rental car. Uninsured motorist this kicks in when the insured vehicle is damaged in an accident caused by an uninsured motorist. It also provides coverage for bodily injury to the insured driver and passengers. Underinsured motorist This differs from uninsured motorist coverage in that it requires that the responsible party is insured but carries limits lower than those on uninsured motorist coverage. Medical payment This provides reimbursement for injury medical payments to an insured driver and passengers in the event of a loss. Third-party auto coverage for an unowned, uninsured vehicle along with its driver and passengers, bodily injury this is for the medical bills as well as the general damages caused to the third-party driver and passengers in the event that the insured driver is at fault for the damage. Property damage similar to bodily injury, it covers the vehicle or other property damaged by the insured driver in an at-fault accident. In order to get these coverages, you need to get a quote. There are three common ways to do so. Through the internet this is quickly becoming the most popular way to obtain a quote for insurance. Direct your browser to a major insurance carrier's website and follow the links. You may receive an instant quote or you may get a phone call or email shortly after requesting one. There are many sites with free car insurance quotes, so don't use any service that makes you pay for quotes. Be sure to compare insurance quotes and if you are a student, check to see if you're eligible for discounts. Over the phone contact your current car insurance carrier directly. Check your declarations page of your policy to find a phone number for policy services. Once you have the number, call and request a quote for the listed coverages. 
Contact a local insurance agent The traditional way of obtaining a quote is to visit your local insurance agent and request one. Once you have your quotes, review the details of each and make sure that the limits are adequate for your needs. Contact the insurance company to let them know that the quote is acceptable and that you would like a policy. Prior to being granted a policy, you may be asked for the following, driver's license and proof of prior insurance, if applicable. Documentation supporting your ownership of the vehicle you are trying to insure. This can include your pink slip or information on the bank that has the automobile loan. To sign a contract. If you are getting the policy through the internet, you may need to print and sign a page and mail it to the insurance carrier. If you are going through an agent, you will sign something in the office. If you request a policy by phone, you can expect to receive a form in the mail to sign and return. An insurance policy is a legally binding contract, thus the reason for the signed pages. You've now signed up for full coverage insurance. Congratulations!